Welcome back, ladies and gentlemen. Here we are with some really good music. It's very eerie, but it's very soft and relaxing. I honestly, I could fall asleep to this. Like, turn Enya off, put this on, I could fall asleep for days. For days. It's very soothing and relaxing, and I'm starting to loosen my shoulders up a little bit. Ah, all right, starting to... Never mind. I could make, I could make jokes, but I will not make jokes about loosening things. Do you wish to know why, Xerx? Who are you? How did you know? That, that is true. That is true. Generally, I'm not going to complain when chicks show up out of nowhere and they know my name, but in this particular case, I mean, I was going to tell you really soon, but how did you already know? <laughs> I can see the- oh, alright, alright, get a ring right now. I know your name and why you come here. Oh good, because I came here for a key. That, that's not very difficult. <laughs> Who are you? Never mind. Don't you want to know why monsters are smarter and attacking humans? I want to know, your name's more important to me right now. Do you know why? Are you aware of a ball of red light that appeared a couple of days ago? Hey, we saw that in the intro and that random NPC mentioned it to us just in case we didn't watch it. So yeah, I am aware. Yes. Everything that's happened has been because of that light. Can't believe that a ball of light has that kind of power. I don't think you understand. It is incredible, but true. But time has begun to change. Now a mere wave, later a gigantic swell. An attack on humanity. That's ridiculous. Why are you telling me this? You have the power, the power to confront that swell. Me? Yes, you. Couldn't be, then who? <laughs> oh god, cookies from the cookie jar. It's true that fighting is my job, I know, but I don't have such great power. What's this ball of light anyway? Is it monster or human? I need to know! What can I do against this humongous enemy of all humanity? It's not just you. There are others in this world who can confront this evil power. You're destined to go on a journey and meet those people, and fight against evil. A journey to fight? That's right! When the ball of light appeared, your destiny was sealed. Will that ball of light really bring misfortune? And I have the power to handle that? This is all I can tell you. I should have read it in a girl's voice. What the hell was I doing? Whatever. That was like some of the worst voice acting I've ever done anyway. I'm just kind of, I'm getting used to reading words again, guys. Cut me some slack. It's episode three. Whether or not you believe me and go on the journey is totally up to you. She is, she's hot. That's right, wait! Don't let her get away, are you kidding? My name is Iris. Iris! Iris! <laughs> what am I fighting for? <laughs> oh god. Cooper, Cooper. Internet high five right there. <laughs> I am here to ascertain your future. If you go, we may meet again. Oh, I'm definitely going now. You leave me no choice, you've made me an offer I can't refuse! Iris, I must know what I'm fighting for. And that's it for our dungeon, guys. We got all the loot. We uh, killed the boss. We uh, killed all the bo bad guys a couple of times. We talked to some hot chick. And uh, away we go. Aw, oh, yeah, I just one-shot the butterfly. I'm going to fight this butterfly then because of it. Aw, oh, yeah. Oh yeah, look out. one shot and butterflies. Can I one-shot the mushroom? I didn't get a surprise attack, but... Yes, I can one-shot the mushrooms! And he gives me a potion and money. See, so I'm not really needing to grind, because I can just do that. Uh, wait a minute, I don't need to go there. I need to go back to the start. Got in first. I guess in a way this is kind of like grinding. I mean, I am clearing the guys out of my way, but it's because I can kill them all in one shot, like, I don't, I don't know, whatever. I'm trying to get first strikes on all these guys. I got a speed up button. No big deal. Get up, stupid controller. I'll skip him that time. Use the door key. And here we are. Uh, we could go back to the first town and talk to people. We probably should. Um, 
Let's just do it. Because it's an RPG, it's a role-playing thing. This is what you would do. You would go home, you would check in. No big deal. Tell people what's up. Tell people what you saw. Tell people you're leaving. You're leaving to go follow this girl who appeared out of nowhere and knew your name. I mean, wouldn't you? Honestly? Some hot chick with green hair and a red dress walks up, knows your name, she can see the future, and she says, follow me. Do you not go? I mean, really. Like, Tia makes bad fish, and this chick knows the future. <laughs> there's no there's no choice to be had. I knew you'd get all those monsters. Tia looked very concerned. Thank goodness you're here. I had this weird feeling. I had this feeling that you were going away somewhere. Uh... Silly me. It's nothing. Uh... Uh... Okay, warps are actually kind of cool. I do kind of want to buy one. I will wait. I don't want to buy that yet, because I'm going to get to a new town very soon. Um, again, I'm going to get to a new town very soon. I don't want to buy anything. I want to save my loots. I don't really need to rest, but I guess I will. Because it should be free. Yeah, and I have a speed up button, so who cares? It took like five seconds. Safe for now. Constant earthquakes there. Monsters are going crazy in Lake Cave. Well, sounds like a mission. Sounds like we're going to investigate some earthquakes in a cave. Tony Stark built this in a cave with scraps. But sir, I'm not Tony Stark. In a cave! Sorry. That was a good movie. The third one was horrible. Oh my god, the third one was horrible. When I was watching, I was like, wow, this reminds me of Resident Evil 6. This is the worst thing ever. I still feel like this is something, but apparently it's not. No big deal. Is there anything else around here? Uh, nope, nothing else around here. That's fine. And now we will finally progress through the rest of this dungeon. Sorry if this pace is a little slow for you guys. It doesn't feel slow for me. So, there's something else right there. We'll go left first. There's a something. Let's check this something out. Shrine to a different kingdom. Cool, we'll come here later. Broken bridge. I already knew that. Um, what else is around? Monsters! It's a mosquito! And I couldn't kill it. And that kind of hurt. Eh, not that bad. Okay, as long as it's still two for one. I'll survive. Oh, I got a crit. A crit kill. That's good stuff. Okay, there's a town. Oh my goodness. It's a blue jelly! Kill the strong one first, because he hurts more. And the red one misses me anyway. Kill the blue jelly. Alright, blue jelly's dead. I can just speed up on the red one. Oh yeah, level up. Yeah, that's a bad level up. I got nothing but agility and magic resistance. Whatever. Um, Alright, so there's not much else around here. There's that random hole in the ground, which is probably the lake cave, considering it's in the middle of a lake. Uh, and then that other town is probably the town. So it looks like we've found just about everything we need to find at this moment. We've done all the exploring. Things will get more complex in their exploration as we progress. Whoa! It's an earthquake! Oh no! Where's the Nidoking? King? Get rid of it! That was a pretty big one. It's a well. Can I go in the well? I cannot. Magic spells. Welcome to Granny's Spell Shop. <laughs> I can learn Droplet, I can learn Poison, I can learn Sleep. But I can't learn Spark. I feel like I should learn Droplet just because, but I, I don't care. I, I, I don't. I'm going to a lake cave. Why would I want to learn water? It's kind of how I feel. What have you got in mind? Um, I don't want those. Shriek, what the hell is that? I guess I'll buy two of them, just because it's cheap. I guess I'll buy two Awakes, just because I can. Um, I'll buy one Warp, because it's handy to do so. And that's it. Do you talk to me? You talk. What do you wish to know? Hey, I will... 
tell you guys about that later. Not that hard. I just can't use any right now, so I'm not concerned about it just yet. A huge catfish makes earthquakes. Really? Uh, sure. Whatever. Legend says the catfish monster lives there. The kids started to believe it. Oh, so it's not true? Alright, well, that's fine. I don't care. Is it a giant man stomping? No, it's a catfish! Jesus! I didn't know you were here. Oh, how do you know me? Do I know all the ladies? Nice. Gives energy, see? What would you like? Alright, what did that chick say? That he likes green tea? I don't remember. I will buy one green tea, just in case. Hopefully it wasn't cider that that chick wanted for her grandfather or whatever. I don't even know what tea does. I never used any during the game when I played it the first time. I haven't slept much. It's the earthquakes. Mm. I'm gonna go take a nap. This is good. I'm gonna steal from your house. <laughs> you have to have stuff worth stealing. Zzz. Whatever, I don't care. Go away. Um, I already went in here. You guys don't have a weapon shop? Are you kidding me? Ah, uh, I should have actually bought that sword then. Ten gold! Capsule monsters. I guess we'll have you tell me. Friendly monsters who join you in battle and help you win. Up to seven capsule monsters will join you in your jersey. In your jersey? In your journey. Whoa. <laughs> There's a capsule monster called Fumi in the woods around here. But it's very hard. Fumi is north between Subtleton and Alun's kingdom. So he's in the woods somewhere. Is that what he just said? I should have listened better. In the woods around here. Okay. I want you guys to nickname my capsule monsters. You know? Man, there is no weapon shop here? I guess I should go back to that town then. Because this guy's got nothing for me. Alright, well... Um... Can I go back? Yeah, I want to buy that sword because I, I expected there to be a freaking weapon shop in the new town and there wasn't. So, I'm going to go buy that. Um... I don't know if I want to start the late cave or just find Fumi and have you guys nickname Fumi for me. Where is the weapon shop? Is it Tia? It's Tia. Alright, I guess I will buy this little knife. It's barely any better, but I'll get it anyway, I don't care. Um, I don't need that. I could get that for another hundred bucks. I guess. I mean, I'm going to be using it for a while, and it's not that expensive. I'll get the 200 bucks back really quick, I'm sure. So, not like there's anyone else around with me. Uh, I guess I'll heal for free. Yeah, I'll heal for free. I'm half dead. If I can run in a straight line. Speed up button's good. Alright, here we go. We're at 13, we're at 14 minutes. I think we're just gonna find Fumi, or try and find Fumi, and uh, I might I might stop it there before we go into the dungeon and get, you know, kind of halfway through a dungeon, you know, before I want to end the episode. I think that's fine. So we just gotta find this Fumi. Vampire? What? miss? I, I don't get it. I guess he tried to restore hit points or something. Do I have... Okay, nope, I don't have anything yet. I will explain that when I get it, then. I will still keep waiting for it. That's the IP thing, the item points. That gold bar at the bottom that has now maxed out. Really? Where are you, Fumi? Foomster, where are you at? Foomster. Hmm. 
Hmm, maybe he's not actually here. Maybe he's... Maybe he's somewhere else. He might very well... Yeah, he must be. He must be after... Oops, wrong button. Now I'm just pushing all kinds of wrong buttons. He must be after I go through that place, because it's still, like, between the town and the kingdom, like that guy said. I was thinking he was in this area, but it, I guess not, so we will heal up. Uh, where's the inn? I'll spend the 10 gold now, that's fine. Good, no earthquake while I was sleeping. That's fine. I went back to that town I forgot to talk to the chick about the tea, whatever. I'm pretty sure it's not even a fetch quest, I just felt like it. Um, I'm sure I'll just kill you, I don't care. Eh, five damage is fine. Alright. Well, I don't really want to end the episode right here, I really don't. What to do? Well first, we're gonna raise the water level. And there's probably not a secret over here, but I kind of want to check it anyway. Oh, I can't even put it down there? I can't even put it there, so never mind. I was thinking make a bridge and then make a bridge and then find an invisible wall, but I guess not. Secrets over here. Nope. Uh, I can't kill any of these guys all in one hit. I guess I'll just kind of pick something. Oh, I got a crit. I take that back. I'll ignore that guy for now and just go through the room. Be brave and dive in. You will find the way. That means I can fall through those things, and I don't really want to fall through them right now. Because it feels very absolute. Uh, there's lots of stuff in here. I don't want to fight you right now. <laughs> I don't want to fight you either. Oh, I found loot! Sweet, another power potion. I guess I'll fight you since you want it. Ooh, you guys look tough. Yeah, they look tough. Ouch! This better kill him. If this does not kill him, I'm dead. Okay, good. Oh my god. Holy crap, dude. I'm gonna heal twice in a row. Ouch, man, that's ridiculous. Those, these dudes are rough. It's a good thing I bought that extra shield, otherwise I might have died. Okay, that was that was nuts. Um, uh, looking for secrets, but there doesn't appear to be any. Okay, um... Oh, crap. I'll kill the mosquito because I know what he's about. I know I can kill him in two. I don't know anything about the frog. Two hit points. I'm at 19. Okay, I'm fine. For now. Polytoad, why you hurt me? Uh, I'm just gonna heal first. I think he was faster. No, I'm faster. Okay. Ribbit, ribbit. Oh, good. He wasted a turn doing nothing. He was loafing around because he doesn't have enough badges. Okay, this place is rough. Now I'm very happy I went back to buy that equipment. Um, um, can't go through there. 
Oh, there's switches over here. Okay. Huh. I did not see them. Oh, really? Whatever. Behind this wall lies the path to the ordeal that awaits you. I'm not even sure. Oh, 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 oh! I found a secret! Okay, there's a lot of dudes right there. Um, but that's totally sweet. I just found a secret. Well, I guess we'll try it. How's my HP? 30 of 56 against the spider boss. Um, I have a power potion too. Strength plus three. All right. Maybe I can one-shot the spiders now. No, because they took three hits last time, didn't they? Or no, the first one took three. The second one I somehow killed in two. So they must have been right at that boundary. But that's fine, I can handle them. That's fine, two hits, dead. Got, got rid of you, now I will heal. I can heal two more times. I'm just gonna get this treasure chest and I think that might be it for this episode. I know it's kind of in the middle, didn't accomplish something per se. Didn't finish anything I should say. Man, there's a lot of guys here. It's a beetle. It's a Heracross! Does that not look like Heracross? Are you kidding me? Wow. Oh, level up. That helps. Five strength. Wow. Maybe that means I can start one-shotting things, like a mushroom. I probably should get... Yeah, I was about to say, I should get him now. Because he was still an earlier enemy. Spider, maybe not. Nope, got him too. That helps a ton. Uh, what are you? You're a beetle? Nope, you weren't a beetle. God dang it. Don't kill me. Don't kill me. Jesus, man. <sighs> I'm barely gonna get anywhere. Okay, I gained 40. I took 13... 25... I like to round, okay? At least I'll be able to kill the eagle. Take less damage, I have to heal again. Man! It's a good thing I did buy those things, I'd be dead. 39 again, 13. Dive! What? What dive? Why you dive? No dives. Caleb, 20 dives. No dives. No dives. Thank you. There's still a bunch of dudes here. Ah, oh, I'm out of MP. Okay, well... I'm gonna get this freaking treasure chest, is what I'm gonna do. I will kill a spider in one hit, because I know I can. Figures! Spoke too soon. Okay. And kill the beetle. Kill the hair cross. Got it. Fight the mushroom. Thank god, I, I know I can kill them. They're easy now. Got another potion. I'm just gonna use this potion, just in case these are eagles and not something else. Just one eagle, that's fine. Eagle 20. Fox 2. What movie is that from? Speedy Ring! That's not the name of the movie, sorry. It's a good movie, though. Uh, equip. Speedy Ring gives me five more defense points and ten more agility. Yes, please. But now, I am going to get the heck out of here. After I kill this mosquito and baby frog. Checking situation, that's good. You, you check that set. Oh, a chop board! He gave me a chop board. That's like a shield, right? Uh, yeah, and I can't use it. So that means somebody else can use it. That's cool. I'm gonna go back to town and rest up. That's what I'm gonna do, and then we'll end the episode. So I'm halfway through the dungeon. Or at least I accomplished something in the dungeon. Oh, I almost fell through there. That was close. I stopped myself right in the nick of time. 
This is why it's nice. If you don't want to fight things, you don't have to fight things. It's good. It's very good. Here we go. Gonna rest at the inn. That's fine. Rested. Good to go. Good to go. And everything's back to normal now, unfortunately. But, whatever. What can you do, eh? What can you do? I'm not gonna bother fighting him. But I am gonna stop it right here. I couldn't save it outside, but I don't really care. I'm just going to... There we go. What's the save button? Um, actually, I want to pick a state first. State, okay. Slot 1. Sure. State 1 saved. Boom. Thank you guys for watching. Uh, in the next episode, we will obviously finish the rest of the dungeon. And uh, we'll see We'll see what happens from there. If there's some big catfish guy. and Oh, yeah. We'll get Fumi. Um, so what I should do... Well, I won't do it. Uh, maybe I will. In the description, I will post a link of what Fumi looks like, so you guys can get a better idea of what to nickname him. Um, and we'll go with that, because we're going to get Fumi next episode for sure, and I want you guys to actually nickname him, which, if I don't do this now, then I would have to stop the episode when we get Fumi, and this way, if we just take care of that in advance, that'll be sweet. I won't have to stop next episode just in case we find him and we're like 10 minutes in. Um, anyway, but that's that, guys. Thank you for watching. Hopefully you're enjoying the LP so far. And uh, let's keep it going. Having a lot of fun. Thanks for watching, guys. Take it easy. Catch you later. Peace.